Hey Pisces, welcome back to the channel guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Pisces, I just thought of something. I just thought of something that I'm going to do and I'm going to do it every day um, starting on February 19th, right? Well, that's tomorrow. Somebody's birthday is tomorrow, right? That's right, yeah, February 19th and March 20th. Yeah, somebody's birthday is tomorrow. Well, anyway, Pisces. Um, so what I was gonna do is what I was gonna say is every day for our little time on this little, you know, this year, you're gonna get a personal reading. So whoever's birthday it is, you're gonna get a personal reading that day. It's it's gonna be whoever's birthday it is, today's your personal reading, and then I'm gonna do it, right? So, all right, guys. Happy birthday, Pisces. Happy early birthday for the people whose birthday is tomorrow. How about it? Happy birthday. Look, I said it first. I said happy birthday to you first. So, remember, if no one hasn't said it to you, Pisces, I said it first. They say, who, who said it? Be like, Debbie said it, right? Debbie said it. Yes. Put a name to it, right? Debbie told me happy birthday yesterday so the rest of y'all can kiss my ass. Right? Yes. That's what you say, Pisces. Because you know we get in our feelings. <laughs> but I'll tell you tomorrow, too. I'll tell you again tomorrow. Happy birthday. But right now, I see that came out sideways. I'm not even going to look at it, Pisces. We're just going to slide that back in here. Actually, let's just put it in the middle. We don't even want to know. Holy Spirit of Pisces. What's going on? Right? What's going on, Pisces? Somebody is feeling very energetic. But things are unbalanced. It's a night of wands. Somebody was moving extra fast, Pisces, in their night of wands energy. Could have been given to other people. It's definitely unbalanced. Could be taken from one person, given to another. Pisces, this could be you, all passionate and everything. You doing what you doing, you know. And then there, somebody could be taken from you, Pisces, and given to other people. Pisces, I think you figured it out. You got clarity on the situation. You're definitely not in hangman. And you're not, you're not asleep. But you are paying attention. You're paying attention. You could be thinking about moving on, Pisces, because it's just unbalanced. It just don't feel good, right? It just don't feel good. Something feels off. Pisces, you're a star. You hopeful. You pour into yourself, you pour into other people. You give to the earth, right? You're the star. But Pisces, something is not working. It's unbalanced and it's just not working, Pisces. As hard as you try, maybe you don't like that job anymore. Maybe you don't like that person anymore. But it's not working. You stop putting in work. I, you probably found out somebody was giving other people. Yep, there's the devil. Pisces, I don't know if you're realizing that you could be addicted to a person. I think you're realizing something. Yeah, here's a hierophant here. Pisces, you're definitely thinking about a connection. You feel attached to somebody. But wherever you're at currently, it's not working. Yeah, there's the three of wands in reverse. Pisces, you could be thinking about moving on because it's not working. And it's not working because it's unbalanced. You're not putting in the work anymore. They're not putting in the work. And you're tired of arguing. You're tired of fighting. 
You don't see yourself going back to this. You see this person as the devil. You feel attached to them for whatever reason. Maybe you're addicted to them. I don't know. Maybe you've been around them for so long. And sometimes we forget that we can't go on without this person. But you could be married to a Pisces. You probably married the devil. You're in a hierophant with it. And there's the emperor here. Pisces, you want stability. Pisces, you're definitely thinking about moving on. Holy Spirit, clarify the six of pentacles in reverse. Queen of Wands. That's the Knight of Wands and the Queen of Wands right next to each other. Pisces, that's where you're trying to get to, but it looks like you're in a hierophant right now. You made a deal with the devil, Pisces. And it's unbalanced. You made a deal with the devil, Pisces, and it's unbalanced. You don't want to be there anymore. Holy Spirit. Pisces, I think you're realizing that whoever this Queen of Wands is, this could be somebody in the public eye, but you also believe that that's where your victory is. That's where your happiness is with that person there. Yeah. Pisces, you probably didn't offer love to this person the way that you thought you should have. And I think you fumbled the gift. Pisces, you fumbled the gift some type of a way. It was a lost opportunity, Pisces, because you're already in a connection. That's why. And everything will not be fine. I think you realize everything will not be fine. So, Pisces, you went and you fell in love with somebody, but you're already in a connection. And you're not up in your head. Like, you know exactly what happened. And you just had a stalemate. You just... You don't know what to do. It's almost like you're not happy where you are. You're not happy in the connection that you're in. It's not working. Um, yeah, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. It's unbalanced. You fight every day. It's like you live in a tower, Pisces. And you feel like you're wasting your time. So, Pisces, you're in a connection. And you're thinking about the person from the past. Look at that. That's on the bottom. Pisces, you feel stuck like Chuck in a rut. You're not happy with your choices, Pisces. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Let's do some digging, guys, right? I'm going to use all of them. See what we get. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Pisces, we got valley, deep personal strength and peace that assures success. We have dolphin, financial gain, usually coming from something you did in the past. And then we have August. So your money is going to be looking good and stuff. But Pisces, you need to get into this valley of your uh, deep personal strength so you can get to your peace. Your peace will bring you to your success. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Have a boat. Money or property through an inheritance winning or windfall. So Pisces, your money is going to be looking good. Love life, not so much. <laughs> Holy Spirit for Pisces. A wedge. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. So there it is. Pisces, you're trying to get to this Queen of Wands here. And whoever or whatever this Hierophant is, this connection here, it could be a business. It could be your business partner. Maybe you fell in love with your business partner. I don't know, but that person 
is getting in between you and this person. You're the Knight of Wands. That's the Queen of Wands. So somebody's getting in between you and this person. Holy Spirit, clarify this wedge. Who is this person getting in between Pisces and where they're trying to go? This person is just bringing you burdens, Pisces. They're bringing you strife. Um, it's the Ten of Wands. So somebody's in your head, in your ear. Yeah, because it doesn't, it's not working. So Pisces, it looks like you could be trying to leave someone and that someone is not having it. Holy Spirit, so they're going to try to prevent you from moving on. Yeah. They don't want to be left out in the cold, this person here. And whoever this person is, Pisces, they're going to pursue you. They're going to, um, they're not going to let it go that easy. Yep, there's your five of swords. They're going to create problems for you, this person. <laughs> Pisces, look over your shoulder. Because they don't want it to end. They know, the person that's causing the wedge, they know you love someone else, Pisces. So they're going to try to stop you from getting to the one you love. But you're leaving them out in the cold, Pisces, with no regrets. Or you're just walking away with no regrets. Yeah, Pisces, I think you're going to push through. You're going to offer this new love to whoever that uh, queen is there. But someone's going to try to stop it, Pisces. Um... Pisces, let's get some truth on you. So this situation didn't disappear by itself, right? I miss you. Pisces, this came out a few times the past few days. That exact same card, I miss you. And I made a huge mistake. Can we get past this, please? Hmm. So Pisces, they made a huge mistake and they won't get past it. What are you going to do, Pisces? Because somebody's going to be calling you up. Or whatever they do. I don't know. What do they do these days? Do they call, text? I don't know. Do people even talk on the phone anymore? I mean, I talk to my sisters and my friends, but whatever, Pisces. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.